Hey yo, what's up, my little coders? Let's solve today the lead code question 367. Valid perfect square. The task is very simple. We just need to say if the input value is a valid perfect square or not. And the valid perfect square is a product of some integer with itself. Let's do that. One of the most trivial solutions would be to iterate from one to the input value and multiply all the possible combinations, all the possible integers with themselves and to check, for example, if the, if the result is equal to the num, then just return true. If it's, for example, greater than num, just return false. However, it's not efficient at all. We want to do it a bit, a bit better. So let's have two pointers. One will point to the left side and another one would point to the right side. We can calculate the midpoint between the left and right. We can square this midpoint. We can check, we can check if the squared midpoint. <coughs> Sorry guys, I have coronavirus. Um, we can check if the squared midpoint is the same as the input value. In this case, of course, we want to return true straight away. Otherwise, in case, for example, if our squared midpoint is greater than the input value, we don't want to check any points after that. So we want to reduce our region of possible candidates for the for this value. In this case, we want to change our pointer a bit. In this case, the right pointer should become middle minus one. And in opposite case, the left pointer should become mid plus one. And in the end, we return false. We return false if we don't find anything and the left becomes greater than right. Let's test it. Perfect, it worked. Let's submit. Brilliant, it was the lead code question number 367. <coughs> Please follow me and subscribe to this channel. Thank you, guys.